is home so hopefully they will not disturb this Ulta Sephora and Milani haul so let's get started all right so first we have some flippies from Milani if you watched my August favorites video you heard me talking about my adorable and it has arrived so let me swatch this for you oh I should have had the um Kat Von D to watch it side by side but there we go perfect dupe for Kat Von D um then I tried this one out this is um sort of a it's called chromatic attic mm. it's not as um dry and long wearing I don't think as the other lippy but that's a pretty cool little shift that it provides so that's really that's really interesting. I'm excited to try it. Okay, let's move on to Ulta. Um, so if you remember the other day, I had already gotten part of my Ulta haul. So the other half came yesterday. I did not touch it. I was waiting for the full kit and caboodle. So the first thing that we have are all these awesome tree huts. Um, the first one is a Shea Sugar scrub in Moroccan Rose. This is probably my favorite scent. Um, I only use two scents of scrubs and lotions. Oh. Oh, I could just smell like this every day. This is $7.99 on Ulta and it smells amazing. Um, my second favorite scent is lychee and plum also $7.99 on Ulta and it <laughs> it just smells sweet but not too sweet fruity but not too fruity perfumey but not too perfumey it's amazing um, I also got the Moroccan rose body butter because I already had well uh, let's be honest I already had the lychee and plum and the moroccan rose um but alta had all of their tree hut buy two get one free so i said you can always use another body better <laughs> oh i love that smell all right so the other thing that i got from alta so i do you when i go to shop in sephora or alta or wherever I, I'm a makeup addict. Like when I tell y'all I have an insane amount of makeup and skincare and all of that, but I tend to always stick with the brands that I have a long standing relationship with. You know what I'm saying? Like me and NARS, we have history. Too Faced and I, we have history. <laughs> so when I go look at products, I look at those brands and I tend to not venture out into brands that I don't have a committed relationship with but Laura Geller and I we're about to go on our first date um, this was $39 um, it came with a free gift as well but we'll talk about that in a second so this was $39 it comes in this cute little bag which I have I have little bags. Um, this is what it looks like in the package. So there's four things that that was an earthquake. I'm not my camera. <laughs> there's um four things in the bag. The first is baked balance and brighten color correcting foundation in medium. So I'm looking at this and I'm thinking this is not a foundation um it's kind of dark you can't see it in my camera it's kind of dark so I'm thinking I'm gonna try this as a bronzer um, the second thing in there is the baked blush and brighten in pink grapefruit 
Now, if you watched uh, my mini haul, you saw that I don't do pinks. Um, so even though this is called pink grapefruit, it's actually quite, I keep knocking the camera. I don't, it's Friday, TGIF, although this probably won't air till like Sunday, Sunday. <laughs> but anyway, it's very similar to that Milani that I tried. Um, even though it says pink, it's more of a plum, got a little pink, maybe a little peachy in it. Um, so I thought it's something that I would wear. Can you see it? And their formula, or her formula, is so soft. I can't wait. And this is the real reason I got it. I wanted to try some of her products. But the main product of hers that I wanted to try, because this is, if you watch YouTube, you have heard about some Gilded Honey. And Gilded Honey came in the package. That is a super pretty highlighter. So this is the real reason I picked it up. The whole set, the five piece, it's called the five piece travel set. It was only $39. So I thought that'll give me a chance to try the Gilded Honey. Come up a Laura. I'm not digging your brush, girlfriend. We'll see. Maybe my, maybe a highlighter brush. Anyway, and then it came with a free gift. Laura Geller Lash Boss. Not opening the mascara because I have a ton of mascara, so we're going to save that for another day. All right, let's take one of these. Um, these are the face wipes that I'm using right now. And I got to say, I don't like them. They're a little too rough on my skin. So let's clean some of these off. Those lipsticks from Milani, they ain't going anywhere. I'm telling you, you need to try the Milani lippies. They're amazing. So amazing. All right. So now let's move to the Sephora box. I don't think there's any makeup in here. I think this is straight up skincare, which is probably my second biggest addiction. So the first thing I, that was my chair squeaking. I have to add, edit some of this out maybe. All right, so the first thing in my Sephora box is, look at that mask. Isn't that crazy looking? Dr. Jart Hydration Lover Rubber Mask. This one mask, $12, $12. This better hydrate, hydrate the shit out of my face. Um, but anyway, first you put on the, um, serum and then you put the mask on. I may do a video trying this out. I will look crazy insane. So remember, there's no judgment here, <laughs> but, uh, if y'all would like for me to try it out on camera, let me know. Okay. The second thing that I got was... Um, this is another oil for my face. I didn't mention it in my August favorites um, because I only had this little teeny tiny sample of it. But from the sample, I loved it enough to try it out. Um, this is the UFO Ultra Clarifying Face Oil. And this is for the treatment and prevention of acne and blackheads. Um, it has salicylic acid in it. So it clears your pores out. But then it has, it's an oil base. So it's, it, it's oil that smooths fine lines and wrinkles. Can we just have a moment of silence for that? Acne treatment and wrinkle fighting. I mean, it's like Sunday Riley created this for me. <laughs> so I really enjoyed the sample size that I had. So Thought, let's go hard and go or go home. This little bottle of oil is $40, but uh, I expect it to be well worth it. Okay, the next thing I got, I'm totally doing a YouTube video on this one, and I'm going to call it YouTube Made Me Buy It. It is Glam Glows Bubble Sheet Oxygenating Deep Cleanse Mask. $9. It says, 
Have fun, get clean. Our first of its kind oxygenating deep cleanse mask with green tea teoxy works to reveal glowing. I'm all about that glow. Uh, deeply purified skin in just three minutes. We will video this too. Okay, next on the list. If you've watched any of my videos, you know I love some Kills Skin Care. Their masks um, are my holy grail masks. So I bought this three mask set. $42. This one here, the turmeric and cranberry, was the first Kills product that I ever purchased. It is the Mac Daddy of all masks. The turmeric deep cleans, purifies, um, all of that good stuff. And then the cranberry, you kind of rub it in, and the cranberry exfoliates your skin. If you buy nothing else Kills, you got to get you some of this mask. Uh, but they had this three pack and I had not tried these two masks from Kiehl's. Even though I've had a lot of Kiehl's masks, never tried these two. This is an ultra facial overnight hydrating mask, which I'm all about that hydrate. And this is the cilantro and orange extract. This is supposed to purify and protect. So I love masks. Um... I used to mask every night. I kind of got off that bandwagon since I moved back home to Virginia. I just don't have time. Like if I wash my face sometimes. No, I'm just kidding. I wash my face every night. But the jars are about this size, so that'll be several, several uses. So, next product. I got my little cheat sheet over here so I can tell y'all the prices. Next product is Shiseido, 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 Shiseido um, Wrinkle Resist 24 Pure Retinol Express Smoothing Eye Mask. Apparently, we are going to instantly reduce the appearance of visible fine lines and wrinkles in just 15 minutes. Uh, this runs for $17.50. And there's three packets in here, so um, three eye masks essentially. But I'll be honest with you, these caught my eye, but I've never tried an eye mask that I didn't like. Most eye masks are really good, so you could go for the cheap one. This ends up being like five dollars and something a mask, so it's actually not a bad deal. Next on our list. A Sephora hair mask. Oh, it's a sleeping mask, so it comes with a little shower cap. Here's the shower cap. Here is the stuff that you put in your hair. This one is the smoothing and anti frizz um, rose hair sleeping mask. Um, I, I, I I don't remember which video it was, but in one of my videos, I told you that I only wash my hair like twice a week. So the night before I'm going to wash it, like let's say I'm going to wash, I washed my hair today. So last night I soaked it in coconut oil and did braids and I slept in it with coconut oil. So I already sleep twice a week with product in my hair. So I got two of these masks actually. Um, I got the coconut uh, sleeping mask which is supposed to be nourishing and repairing so we'll see if these work any better than my traditional straight up organic coconut oil if they do I'll let you know these masks were five dollars a piece so we shall see next up on my list is oh, Laura Mercier secret brightening powder for under the eye um, I usually use that Milani powder that I was telling you about yesterday, but there is a little flashback. Um, I, I don't know, you can kind of tell it in the videos, but not so much. So I wanted to try this um, for under my eyes instead of the Milani. I will just tell you, all the rage on YouTube 
is the Laura Mercier setting powder. Everyone says it's the holy grail. It's the bomb. It's the shit. Uh, I, I did not like it. <laughs> I, I used it. I mean, I liked it. It was good. But I did not understand what all the rage is about. I mean, you're just, you might as well just go with any other. It was nothing special, I guess is what I'm saying. It was a setting powder. Um, but I didn't, I have been wanting to try this for a long time. This itty bitty teeny tiny little thing was $26, but it's just for your under eye, so it should last a while. All right, next up in this haul, this is the product I'm probably most excited for. I could never pronounce some of these. Caudalie, Caudalie, we're going to go with Caudalie, $42, it's a toner, um, this toner, it's a revolutionary new formula to unveil brighter, softer, and refined skin in a single step, I think that's possible for this little liquid to do all that, we'll see, um, smell it. A YouTuber made me buy it. I watched on their video. I had ran out of toner. So I thought, since I got to replace anyway, let's try this Vino Perfect Essence and see if it works. Cross your fingers on that one. Um, okay, the rest is just, I had a coupon, so I got me a little travel size as my Urban Decay all nighter setting spray love this setting spray it is the best setting spray i've ever used i travel a lot for work so i thought perfect um i also had enough points if you are a sephora user you know you get points with those points you redeem the points for free products so i, I think this was a 500 point product um it's the fantastic Four by Peter Thomas Roth. Let's see what comes in here, Peter. So we have the Firm X Peeling Gel. Visibly roll, lift, and sweep away dead skin cells when massaged into the skin. This multi action enzymes and cellulose help uncover a smooth, fresh, new complexion. Sounds good to me, Peter. Uh, it also came with the Irish Moore Purifying Mask. I have used this mask before. Not my favorite mud mask. Um, but I will say as far as mud masks go, this is the less drying mud mask. So if you have dry skin and you've tried other mud masks and they just depleted your skin of what little moisture you had, this is a good option because it's anti-aging and so it doesn't dry your skin out. But if you're looking for something charcoaly to dig deep in those pores and you're not really concerned about keeping your face moisturized because you already produce moisture, probably not the one you want to go with. Uh, the third thing in here, water drench, hyaluronic cloud cream, hydration for up to 72 hours. Never used it. Can't wait to try it. Uh, I'm trying to talk fast because my last video was like 30 minutes. And anti-aging cleansing gel. Um, I have used this cleansing gel before. It brightens with glycolic acid. I've used all of his cleansers. I've went through each and every one. So here's the pros with his cleansers. You get quite a bit for the price. So... They seem a little expensive. The price point is a little high, but they last forever. <laughs> so it actually is a pretty good deal. Um, I mean, it cleans the skin. I can't tell that any of his cleansers did anything extra. It, they cleaned my skin. Did I see results with anti-aging? No. With the Irish Moore cleanser, did I see clearer skin? No. But they cleaned the skin. So, 
can't recommend them, but because they don't do anything super fantastic. How's that? But they do get your skin clean. So, um, what else we got going in here? I got a little sample of Give Me Give Me Brow. This was not the sample. So you get three free samples when you place a Sephora order. I only got two. And only one of them was the one that I picked. So I was a little ticked about that. And Sephora, you done this to me twice now. Come on. So they gave me a little sample of Gimme Brow. It doesn't even tell me which. So I I use Gimme Brow. Um, but I use the number three. And this Oh, this is the number three. So you know what? I'm not too mad at you, Sephora, because I may be able to just throw this into my suitcase when I travel instead of packing my actual Gimme Brow. So I'll take it. Now, this is the one that I did pick out. This is the NARS Radiant Primer. Never used this primer before. Can't wait to try it. And for my second year in a row, I have hit VIB Rouge. So I got a free VIB Rouge gift for hitting that status. If y'all don't know, that is the Mac Daddy status. Basically, what that says is a bitch spends way too much money on Sephora. <laughs> and they say you get all these perks. I don't know that you get that many perks. But, um, I mean, look at this little red case. VIB Rouge. They've been fancy now. They are being fancy. Um, VIB Rouge 2017. It's going to be a beautiful year. Uh, whatever. I don't need any of that. So let's just check out this brush because the packaging. You know, some people when they're on when they're on YouTube, they talk about the packaging. I don't care about the packaging. Um, it could be cheap packaging. It could be now. There has been a few products that came in such beautiful packaging. I displayed it all around my vanity, but overall, packaging to me is just a little bit of a waste. So, enjoy this bestseller from the Sephora collection. Um, very soft, dense bris bristles. Um, might be a good contour i can dig it and it's free so all right there you have it my sephora and ulta haul um i will not tell you how much money i spent in these two hauls because um you know it's kind of like your age a girl just a girl never tells but anyway um all right let me know in the description box or in the comment section what you would like to see me try, I will try the two face masks and videotape it for you live so you get to see this bare face without all this, all this. <laughs> um, I'll try those online. I'll let you know how the masks do. If you want to know details about anything else, just let me know. Um, have a great, great weekend, although the weekend will probably be over by the time I post this. But uh, anyway, 